fragrances because the heat is all you need to just sort of give them that extra fragrance to wear when you're going somewhere really quick and you're coming back point of this i'm not mad at the performance i think i'll just pray again for the my people my people welcome back to my channel and if it's your first time seeing my face then salutation my name is priscilla aka cc aka prissy aka ila aka silla aka miss prissy baby and i make videos to help you smell good look good and feel good so if that's something you're interested in then please consider subscribing like this video and let's get right into the video of today <laughs> I'll be talking about a fragrance called Donna by Trusadi. So you have seen from the title already. We'll be talking about this fragrance. Um, I originally first heard about this fragrance from another YouTuber called Marcelina Theresa. So please feel free to go check her out. Um, yeah, she talked, said she said some really good things about the fragrance, and I thought, why not? I'll try it and share my thoughts with you guys on my channel as well. So if that's something you're interested in, if you're interested in hearing about Donna by Trusadi, without further ado, let's get right into the video. So I'll be talking about this fragrance in 5P categories as usual, guys. By now, you should be able to recite it with me. Packaging, performance, projection, price, and I'll be finishing it off with my personal thoughts. So guys, let's start off with the package. So I'll start off first of all by talking a bit about the fragrance, giving you a bit of background. So Donna is an amber floral fragrance that was, that came into existence or I don't know what better word to use, in 2011. It was manufactured design in 2011 and it's an amber floral fragrance. Now guys, if you know me very well, amber floral is my juice. It's my thing. It's like, you know, it's my thing. If it's not amber floral, give me a bit of spice and I'll be there. Like, I'll be there. So, um, now that we've gotten that out of the way, the fragrance comes in this white box. Um, okay, so that's focus. And you just see that it says Trusadi there and it says the name of the fragrance below, which is Donna. So yeah, that's focus. I got it in the 50 ml. As you know, guys, I do not buy 100 ml of bottles because I'm trying to get through all my fragrances. I'm not a collector. Um, and it comes in this white bottle with a gold cap. I think that it's such an elegant packaging in my opinion. Like, I just think it's so elegant. I'm just trying to get it to focus. So yeah, that's it. And on the bottle, it just says Trusadi and it says Donna as well. It's got this gold cap and then to the sides, it's got the gold lining as well. All through on the sides, as you can see, nothing spectacular about the bottom. But let's talk about this cover. I just think it's so elegant. The inside is white. Yeah, as far as I'm concerned, and actually it's embellished on here and it says Trusadi. 1911 which i is i think is when trusadi came into existence i think that's when the company was founded it's an italian company by the way so this is an italian fragrance the other fragrance i have in my collection that is italian i think or is an italian brand is zerjov i think zerjov is italian so if we go by zerjov and zerjov makes really nice fragrances then let's see if trusadi would meet up Okay, so going into the performance of this fragrance, I'll start off by reading off the notes for you. It's got notes, fruity notes, yuzu, amalfi, lemon, jasmine, African orange flower, lotus, vanilla, sandalwood, patchouli, and Virginia cedar. Now, amalfi is a coast in Italy, so probably the lemon is from there. Um, so they've sourced some things, you know, in their home base. What really attracted me to this fragrance? I had Obviously, I said Marcy had talked about it, but as soon as I went and checked the notes and I had seen fruity notes, oh my goodness, that got me immediately. Because you know the other fragrance in my collection I have that has got fruity notes? It's Eba Pura. Eba Pura by Zerjov. I talk about it a lot on this channel. And Eba Pura has got the, those fruity notes um, to it. So I was like, okay. And you guys know how much I love my Eba Pura. So I thought I'd actually grab my Eba Pura and show it to you quickly. This is Eba Pura. I talk about it a lot on this channel. And as soon as I saw that this fragrance, Donna by Trisadi had, you know, fruity notes in it. I was like, okay, I'm going for it. I'm not thinking about it. I'm definitely going for it. So it arrived and I'm 
let's smell it and then i'll talk about the performance i have tried this before i'm not unboxing it this is not me unboxing this with you guys i have tried this on to see what the performance and the projection is like i'll just spray again for the you know we're doing a fragrance video so we may as well okay this is such a beautiful scent guys it smells sort of floral just as it says that it's amber floral this is exactly amber floral but it dries down a bit creamy and the the more it dries down it dries down quite sweet and that's because of probably the patchouli and the vanilla notes in the base notes this is such a beautiful beautiful fragrance i really really like it it's such a nice scent um it is it's it doesn't it's not a skin scent so when you spray this on you'll be able to smell it in terms of the projection you i personally feel like you may have to do a few more sprays and two sprays to have get this to project so you're going to have to wear this you know all over for it to really really project for you to get people to be able to smell this on you on my skin i just felt like after about four hours it kind of went very quiet um and I'm not upset with that because for the price point of this, we're coming to the price guys. But anyways, for the price point of this, just speaking very quickly on the price, for the price point of this, I'm not mad at the performance. I think the performance, the packaging and everything match up the price of this fragrance. So in terms of the projection, I think it projects really well. I don't think it's the most loud performing fragrance, but it is a nice fragrance to have. It's a nice fragrance to wear when you're going somewhere really quick and you're coming back home. It's not a fragrance to wear throughout the day, you know, for a whole day and you think this will still be there at the end of the day. I think you can wear it to work, but I think it might go missing. If it's a kind of work I do, this might not last you till the end of the day. You might have to top this up. This actually comes in the 100 ml, 50 ml and 30 ml. So, you know, you can go for any of the sizes. I think it's a really nice fragrance anyways. Yes, it's it's got really lovely projection. It's got re it's, it performs well. It's just that after four hours, four to six hours, you know, it's not really going to be there. That is my experience with it. I tried it, and that was my experience with it. In terms of the price points, this currently retails in pounds sterling. So I'll be reading the price in pounds. Thirty ml retails for twenty three pounds eighty nine. The fifty ml retails for thirty two pounds fifty eight, which is the size I have got in my hands. And the 100 ml retails for £47.50, which I think is very, very sensible. I personally think that that's a very good price point for a, a nice fragrance. Um, it's not niche, it's designer. Trisadi, they do many other things. They design many other things. I think this fragrance was created to mark their 100th anniversary or something like that. And to be able to get a 100 ml or 100 ml perfume for under £50, that's quite... That's an all right, that's an okay price, you know. Um, so again, I think it's a really lovely fragrance. I definitely recommend this. Now, in terms of my personal thoughts, I do recommend it. I think it's lovely. However, I think it's more of a summer spring scent. In fact, a summer scent. And that's purely because when I have a fragrance in my hand that struggles with projection, for me, I feel warmer weathers are nicer for such fragrances because the heat is all you need to just sort of give them that extra boost or push. The way it smells as well, those fruity notes, those floral notes, the sweetness, you know. I personally think that this is a beautiful summer scent. Very easy to wear, very easy on the nose as well. The packaging is beautiful. Um, is it blind by worthy? Yes, I think it's blind by worthy. Um, I think it's blind by worthy. I don't really see anything in this that would irritate anyone. I think this leans very feminine. I personally think this is a feminine fragrance, but go ahead, do you. Do what makes you happy. But I personally would rather smell this on a lady. Um, but yeah, is there any other thing I'm missing? I think that's it for this fragrance. If you've tried this fragrance, if you've tried this fragrance, comment it down in the comment section. Let me know. If you've tried any other fragrances from the Trusadi line, I'm very interested to know also let me know and if you're looking to actually go out and purchase this purchase it and let me know in the comment section what you think I look forward to hearing from you now go ahead and do all of that good stuff like share and subscribe guys like share and subscribe help me grow my channel it's my channel but it's our channel help me grow this community together and see you again in my next video or to see you again in my next video stay blessed come today you get a pet Mwah. hi and bye